A reusable learning object is a resource which students can use to practice a closed skill and to learn. In this presentation, I'll be talking about a specific reusable learning object that I created for a first year module in academic skills so that they could train for their summative assessment on transcription, that is transcribing audio um, into written, written language. So I used Google Forms to create this reusable learning object and I'll be able to roll this out to students again and again and again in different co cohorts at different levels. Um, and it's reusable in that way. So first we'll look at the student using the reusable learning object. This is Google Forms and the instructions here say view the video and transcribe below. So they can play the video in frame and they start to write down what the, the news presenter is saying. They can pause it and put it back to the start if they want, keep working at it till it's finished. They're then asked to use their transcription to comment on the nature of the dialect in question. The nice thing about these forms is that as soon as the student submits and views score, they'll get feedback. So they can view the video again, they can see what they have written, and they compare it to the feedback which has been prepared by the tutor in advance. They can then look to see if the answers they have given about the dialect match what the tutor has written. So there are 10 examples here given. The student was asked for one or as many as they wanted. I use this in a blended approach in my classroom. The students work on this reusable learning object online. They then compare their given answers to the full script and make a note of their errors. They then correct those errors and they use the rubric that will be used ultimately in the summative assessment for the transcription exercise to grade their formative assessment. Now, this grade doesn't count for anything, but it gives them a sense of what they need to do to improve. The instructor view then looks the same as the students, but they can click over to responses and view what students have written. So there are, you'll note there are no names or email addresses attached to, the, attached to these answers, and it's been set up expressly for that reason, but you can get a sense of how the students are doing, what they're understanding, and where some work is needed on a modular level. So there's some exa examples here that could do with some work. A note of caution, I use Google Forms for formative assessment only. I do not store any student data, no numbers, no names, no email addresses. Summative assessment should be confined to our VLE um, and student data should not be kept in other places. So important to note as well is that you must check all of your materials for copyright clearance. So any videos, images or text that you have the, the, the permission to use those materials in the Google Form. So how do you make one of these? You go to Google Forms and you click in. You click on blank and you can start immediately. You can type in the title and you can start populating questions. We all have access to this because we have UCD.ie email addresses. So what is Diohut? And then we can give MCQ option answers. Hello, goodbye. And we can require that the student answers this question and forces them to answer. To add an extra question, simply press on the plus. You can choose the question type as well, what answer you want, a short answer, paragraph answer, MCQ. You can customize the look by changing the color. Then you can send out your form in an email to students. And you can include it in the body of the email if you want them to jump straight in. Or you can get a link and shorten the URL where you could post to, to your VLE or send in an email right on a whiteboard. So, what is the educational benefit of these reusable learning objects? So this assessment helps to clarify what good performance is by allowing students to compare where they're currently at to where they should be. It shows them a perfect script, encourages time and effort in that the transcription takes time, and it facilitates the development of self-assessment and reflection in learning by giving them the space to compare what they've done to the standard that has been laid down by the ideal script. 
So in summary, I used Google Forms to create this reusable learning object and we all have access to this because of our UCT.ie email addresses. This type of formative assessment encourages practice, reflection on learning and reiteration. The student can take this test as many times as they want to improve. It self-corrects, which is a joy for the tutor, and it is reusable. I can roll this out to any cohort um, as long as Google Forms exists. So that's reusable learning objects with Google Forms from Owen McAvoy in the Irish Language Lab, the School of Irish, Celtic Studies and Folklore in UCD.